Order. Question number five, Jonathan Young. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question to the Minister of Energy and Resources and asks what recent announcement has he made about block offer 2014? Mr Speaker, Honourable Simon Bridges. Today I announced the start of the Block Offer 2014 consultation process. A total area of ju just under 434,000 square kilometres across five offshore and three onshore areas are being consulted on with relevant iwi and councils. The mixture of proposed areas offers a range of mature and frontier acreage in order to appeal to a diverse range of operators and help promote a stable path to future oil and gas production. Feedback received will inform final decisions about the makeup of the block offer tender, which I expect to open in December of ne April, I should say, of next year. Supplementary. Supplementary question, Jonathan Young. How is the block offer process received by industry? Mr. Speaker, Simon this morning I spoke to a 300-strong crowd at the second wow. annual New Zealand Petroleum Summit. They hung off every word, Mr. Speaker. The summit attracted leading explorers and producers, including those currently operating here and those looking to New Zealand for opportunities. Block Offer 2014 will be the third time this government has used the competitive tender round to grant permits and feedback from industry on the process continues to be enthusiastic. Industry, like this government, wants, want to strategically manage and maximise the returns from our resources in an environmentally responsible and safe way. Oh, here we go. Supplementary question, Moana Mackey. Why is he charging ahead with exploration in the exclusive economic zone when the so-called environmental protections his government have put in place are woefully inadequate, when there are serious questions over our ability to respond in the event of an emergency, when there is zero guarantee of any local benefits such as local jobs or procurement policies, especially given that the blowout that led to the Deepwater Horizon disaster occurred in an exploratory well? Honourable Simon Bridges. Mr Speaker, the uh, member asking the question is completely wrong and ignorant in what she says. But I agree with the new economic development spokesman for the Labour Party that actually government needs to assuage whatever anxieties might be there in the minds of employers or of future investors uh, in Taranaki and in the oil and gas, and that actually sustainability is as much about sustaining the livelihood of people as it is about guarding the ecological habitat of the Hochstetter frog. Order. Question number six. Jacinda Ardern. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Minister for Social Development and